Spirit just dropped another teaser. Ah! Oh my gosh, Spirit Hollows 2017, 2017. The gargoyles, the gargoyle from the lunging Lily is returning. What? Slim? What? It's like Cackle still clan from Lowe's? What? What these random people? I've never heard any of these people before. Laughing. Why is everyone laughing? The keeper has a the What is happening? Oh. That's it. Well, the thing is, Spirit just dropped a bomb on this, along with all the other companies also releasing because it's freaking June. We have the Spirit Hollows Cemetery. Here's the video that we just watched, and then we have all the tombstones with supposedly animatronic names. Because I can see Creepy Rising Doll right here with her tombstone, and it looks sick. Oh my gosh. Her face, like, cracked in half on the tombstone is so sick. And all of these tombstones as well look really detailed. They're like on Home Depot tombstone level now. This is amazing. We have Grave Watcher. Grave Watcher is returning. Leatherface, a third freaking Leatherface. We have Party City Lowe's and a Spirit... Leatherface now, are you serious? And then we have a Slim coming, finally. After Shorty, we get a Slim animatronic, please. Let's freaking go. And the tombstone is his design on the clothes as well. And then for some reason, Stilt Clown? What? That's at Lowe's. Spirit's not taking Lowe's props, right? It's gotta be another clown. Yeah, I kind of just skimmed through all the tombstones really fast, but let's like go back up. So we have the Black Heart. Here lies the Black Heart. Be careful about what you wish for. And that is a tombstone. And I'm assuming that's gonna be an animatronic name. So is it gonna be like something that rips out its heart? That would be pretty insane. And the tombstone as well looks really good. We can see a heart right there with like a flower-ish design. And of course it has like all the text and stuff. So very interesting that has to be an animatronic for this lineup. Pretty exciting. And then next we have the Cauldroness. This might be like a witch prop. Because I can see like a beaker, just like a potion bottle like a witch would have. It says keep your kids close. I don't have any kids yet, but thanks. But yeah, so this might be a witch prop. The tombstone as well looks really cool. And then of course we have Creepy Rising Doll. She is pretty much officially returning at this point. And then we have Dagger Mike. He's gonna have a dagger and his name is Mike. No more tricks. And the tombstone as well looks really sick. And we have Darling Dolly. That definitely sounds like an animatronic name. She has to be a doll prop. It already has like this doll look like with the eyes right there. So it's pretty cool. Here lies Darling Dolly forever changed. So it's gotta be a doll animatronic. Hopefully it's really cool. And then we have Death Stalker. His hunger was insatiable. This sounds really promising. Just the name Death Stalker is so sinister. I love that. I love that. And the tombstone also looks really cool. And then we have Desmodius. That's gotta be like a freaking bat prop. Look at the wings on the tombstone. Desmodius, born mean. Okay, okay. This is also pretty hype, pretty promising. Hopefully it's a pretty cool animatronic. Desmodius. Then we have Eternal Rest. Eternal Rest is also a sick name as well. Oh my gosh. You can see like two eyes right here on the tombstone as well with like a cracks and stuff. Their love was doomed. That sounds pretty interesting, pretty sick. Then we have Grave Watcher all the way from 2013 returning? That is interesting. I wouldn't expect for her to return. I mean, it does make sense because it's a graveyard theme, so it has to be here. Like, she has the- it's the candle right there. It's literally the candle on Grave Watcher. So, in loving memory, Grave Watcher, forever vigilant. So, she's returning too. Let's go. It's a pretty cool flashback. I mean, personally, I didn't like her or really remember her that much back in the day. I did see her in store all the way back then, but she wasn't like a standout. I mean, she does look pretty cool. I like her look a lot. It's pretty, like, you know, sick looking. Looks pretty creepy for a doll. There's gonna be a lot of doll stuff. And then next we have Heckles, which I thought at first was Cackles in the trailer. Definitely not. It's Heckles. Anything for the last laugh. Okay. That could be a clown, though, still. Maybe. Hard to tell. It looks like there's balloons. That, that's balloons. Those are literally balloons. It has to be a clown. Okay. That's definitely a clown. And then we have freaking Hellspawn. Jeez, we got another devil prop. That is definitely a devil prop. You can see the horns and all that stuff. And then, oh my gosh, look in the back. That's the stilts one. And then we have Leatherface, a third Leatherface prop. Like, what the heck is going on with that? Why is everyone making leather faces here oh my gosh hopefully spirit has a good one too party city is probably the best one we have right now though then next we have poor george which that also looks like a clown face i don't yeah he's okay literally it's another clown it's another clown or i swear that says teary it's that says george okay poor george he was a good clown though his body survived his mind was tormented okay okay let's go let's go that sounds sick that sounds sick and then we have slim let's go and then we have stilts and it has a bowling pin why does stilts have a bowling pin and why did they why is it called stilts bro it's literally lows he would do anything to be the best Ooh, what does that even mean is he gonna be the best animatronic we'll see but why he has a bowling pin that's pretty crazy like a pin clown okay okay and yeah that's pretty much all the tombstones this is super 
super interesting. I've never really seen Spirit do this kind of. Like, of course, it's been done in a way, but they're just tombstones with the animatronic names on them. And what I think could actually be a possibility, which would be insane, is that all of these will be sneak peeked each week and, like, every tombstone would be unveiled, but, like, I don't think so. But th that'd be pretty cool, though. Pretty cool. This thing is so confusing, though. It's just all tombstones. It's like the 2020 teaser where they drop basically, like, a sneak peek of the entire lineup, but they're all tombstones. They're all just tombstones. So that is kind of weird, but what I think they actually are doing is potentially every week, just like sneak peeks, they'll unveil a tombstone. So Slim, Leatherface, Darling Dolly, they could be a once a week reveal as they reveal all the tombstones in the lineup. Cause there's so many tombstones there and they're all animatronic names. Just so much happening right now with Halloween, like Party City and Kotsko and Lowe is now Spirits. There's just, there's just so much happening and Spirit, it looks, it's gonna be crazy. I'm just so overwhelmed. I think I'm just gonna like, I'm just gonna pass out. Mm -hmm.